It's Alyssa, welcome back to my channel. Today I decided that since I just finished up kind of redecorating slash remodeling, mostly just redecorating my room, that I wanted to give you guys a little room tour. And I just wanna show you guys where I keep everything and where everything is, so let's go. First off, I have this little paw print of Mocha right here. Okay, let's go in. <laughs> welcome to my room. You'll notice that in my room, I have kind of different areas for my different styles, I guess. So over here, I really like, I think it's like my vintage skater side. So up here I have my six favorite vinyls that I have. And then down here I have all my extra ones, not extras, but just the ones I didn't make the top six, I guess. Um, I have a little fine line poster I painted, my speaker, Polaroid, disposable camera, my perfume. Then I have this little jar of the little like foam things. I still don't know what to call these. If you know what they're actually called, let me know in the comments down below. But then I have this little jar of water or cup of water, I guess, that I just put them in sometimes just for fun when I feel like it. Next up, I have this sign that says, don't stop until you're proud. I change it sometimes, but I really like this quote, so I haven't changed it in a while. And then here's my record player. Getting over here, this is my closet and you have to open it from the top or the bottom, but I always open it from the top because there is no knob here because it came off and now there's just no knob so and then also it kind of runs into the christmas lights but you still have to be careful <laughs> i know the closet kind of looks like a mess but it's an organized mess so over here i kind of have all my dresses and jackets and then this is my dirty clothes hamper down here i keep all my extra shoes that i don't wear on a daily basis here's my art supplies and then just a couple other things then here I keep my sweatshirts. These are the ones I don't wear most days. And these are the ones I tend to grab for more. And then up here I have just some storage things. And also if you see this, this is my robe and I just don't have a place for it. So it just sits up there, but I put it there on purpose. So I just want to let you know that. <laughs> All right, next up I have this little like crate rack type thing um, on the top. This is from like all the colleges in my area that just send me stuff every month that I don't know what to do with. And then down here, I have mostly sunglasses, but I also have a pack of tissues that I grab for like show car competitions and stuff when I need a travel size because I do be on that allergy grind. <laughs> and down here, I have stickers and just a couple letters from people. Then on this bottom shelf down here, I don't ever touch the stuff down here, but this is the stuff from when Mocha was a baby or when we first got her, see how like, gross this color is and it's so tiny like that used to fit around mocha and then i have this little super Ann costume she used to wear but she's a lot bigger now so but i can't bring myself to get rid of it and then i also have a little her little blankie down here but she doesn't really use it anymore because she's a husky so she likes to be cold and then i have this little stingray guy that i got from the Henry Dorley Zoo in Omaha, Nebraska, and his name is Raymond. Then I also have this guy who actually doesn't have a name. So if you wanna name him, comment down below and I'll actually like give him one of the names that somebody comments. But he is from the Mammoth site in South Dakota. Not sure what city it's in, but it's in South Dakota. <laughs> and then up here, of course, we have Smokey the Bear overlooking everything because he's in charge. I have this little bucket down here. It's full of like my curling irons and my flat iron. Um, then I have my skateboard and then my shoe rack. I have all my bands on the top and then down there are my tennis shoes and right here I have everything else. These bands used to be up here but then they kept falling so that's just the way it is now. <laughs> and then I have my bucket hat here. Then right here I have this like, I'm not even exactly sure what it is. I think it's just kind of like a Wait, I don't even know what it is. I got it for Christmas. And then this is a thing that you can put in the bathtub and it, you can like lean on it so you can like relax in the bathtub. And I always forget it's here. Like I've never used it and I want to, I just always forget it's there. <laughs> and then here, the biggest thing in my whole entire room, it's my bed. And then this is a blanket that obviously doesn't match anything else in my room, but I always keep it on top of my bed. When I get chilly, cause my room is always cold, I have a blanket and so I don't have to like, mess up all my covers because I make my bed every day and that's really frustrating to have to make your bed twice a day. 
All right, and then on this side of my bed, I have my flag banner thing from CIY. It's a church camp that travels all across the US. I even think that CIY might go to some other countries, but not totally sure. Um, I have my uh, hula flowers or Hawaiian flowers. I don't know what the right name is, but I just have some flowers hanging from my ceiling. This is my corsage from Winter Ball this year, but I wasn't able to go because I got sick. Um, I've said that so many times because it makes me sad, but this is my corsage that we had because I was gonna go, but then I couldn't. <laughs> um, and then I just hung up my kinkin bag. I don't know how to say the other name, so just call it a kinkin. And then back here, I have all of my other bags that like I use for show choir, cross country, tennis, other just backpacks. And I also have my heating pad back there. Then on my nightstand, I always have this water bottle here, like 90% of the time, because if it's not with me somewhere, it's in here. <laughs> then I have this like spinny thing. It's actually made for pencils, but honestly, it's so smart to get one of these. Um, keep my remotes in here, some Vicks, my AirPods. Then on this side, I have all my journals and Bible things, calendars, planners, my pens and this drawer right here is filled with just some random bracelets. Right here is my corsage from Winter Ball last year, and then this is just my calendar. Down here I have a trash can that I thought I needed to write the word trash on when I was like 12 in diamond lettering. I didn't need to do that. I have this like food tray here, so whenever I bring food up here, I can put it up here so that way I don't spill anything because white bedding spills does not mix. Here's my curtains. I've had them since like forever. <laughs> um, I just never changed them because I don't see the point. I mean, they're for the most part, they're just black. So that's the way they are. I always have cords down here because that's just where I plug in my things. And then I have a humidifier down here for when my allergies are really bad. That kind of helps a lot, especially since it's like right next to my bed. So when I sleep, it's not so bad. Then right over here, I have this chair that this is how I get ready every morning. I'll just bring it over here in front of my mirror. I can sit in front of it and do my hair and my makeup and stuff without having to have like a whole nother vanity. It just saves space. And over here is just out of the way and easy to grab. Then I keep my tripod and ring light here. Up here, I just have some art I made. And then right here, I have a few pictures of me with a couple of my friends and Mocha, of course. This thing right here is actually, I bought it for my locker room during cross country season, but when it wasn't cross country season anymore, I needed to take it out. So now it just sits in my room and I'll probably take it back to the locker room at some point, but right now it's just in my room. <laughs> Here's my she who shall not be named. Don't want to alarm her or anything. And then I got this little turtle from Reptile Gardens. And then this is a rosary. And then this is where I keep my earrings. It's sparkly and has an A on it. This is the other corsage thing. I don't think that's actually the right name for it, but from Wonder Ball this year, because of course, since I didn't go, Alex didn't go. So I just have both of them because he just never got his, I guess. And then this is my necklace from prom that I also didn't get to wear because prom was canceled. So that's awesome. And then here I have where I keep all my necklaces and bracelets and it looks like a big mess and that's because it kind of is <laughs> um these are my two favorite necklaces and the reason that they're not on there is because actually at the moment they're tied together um i really can't get them undone i just have some candles hidden back here and i like to keep them back there because i switch them out throughout the seasons i have some fall some summer and some winter back there right here i have my hair stuff like my hair accessories so down here i have my hair coils and then these three, or four I guess, are filled with scrunchies and they are color coordinated. Oops. They're kind of filled to the brim, but so red, blue, and this is every other color, and then this is white, black, and gray. And then in here I have clippy barrettes, and then in here I have more just fancier barrette clippy type things. Up here I have my essential oils for my diffuser right here, and a lighter for my candles, and then here's my necklace that Alex gave me. I broke the chain because I'm an awful person. Right here, I keep my makeup brushes or some of them. 
And then here's a tiny mirror, and then here's my big mirror. Um, I have some Polaroids on here. These are a lot older, and then these ones are a lot newer. I keep a lot of my makeup brushes actually in my makeup bag. I used to keep a lot of my makeup in these drawers, especially like my everyday makeup that I keep in these ones. But as I got into more show choir and things like that, I needed a lot more makeup. And this is the bag I would take with me to all my show choir competitions. So it's a really nice bag. I definitely recommend getting it. It's from Amazon um, up here. It keeps all your makeup brushes and then it has nice little dividers down here so you can put all your makeup in it and have everything fit perfect. And so ever since I got this, I just really stopped putting my makeup back in here because I just didn't really see the need for it. So I do keep some of my makeup brushes in here and then I just keep this right here because every day that I need my makeup, um, I can just grab it here. But I actually do keep my everyday mascaras up here so they're really easy to grab. Then back here, I just have some like cleaning things, I guess. I have Clorox wipes, a lint roller, Febreze, and Germex, and also ibuprofen and tape. I use tape a lot in my room. Right here's a little paper from one of my show choir retreats where people just wrote things about you. So there's that. And then here is my little cross country corner, I guess. Up there are my shoes that I ran in last year. I don't wanna hear about them. I know they're not good for running. I don't wanna hear it, but that's what I ran in last year. <laughs> and then these are the bibs from most of my meets, not all of them. I actually didn't save all of them because I didn't think about saving all of them, but here's most of them. <laughs> and then a couple of these are medals. This is my academic Allstate medal, and this is my 12th place medal from another meet. And then down here on my doorknob is where I keep my lanyard for like my keys and stuff. All my other family members keep their keys downstairs hung up on this thing by the door, but I would always forget to take my keys out of my backpack or like when I came in, they would just be in my hand or whatever. And so I just started keeping them here because it's really hard to lose them when I always put them here. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching my room tour. I really hope you enjoyed it. Comment down below what your favorite part of my room is, or if you hated it, let me know. <laughs> Please don't let me know if you hate it. That would make me so sad. <laughs> if you like this video, don't forget to like it down below. And if you want to see more just like this, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.